Hey everybody, this is Jace with ArmUS, and right now we're here with Dean from Evolve Dynamics, and we're taking a look at this platform. Give us the quick spiel. We just got this up in the air. It's a little smoky today, but we still were able to pull it off. But we just put this in the air. Really impressive little package. Thank you. Talk, talk to us about it. Where are you coming from? And, uh, and kind of give us some of the highlights here. Yeah, so this is the Evolve Dynamics Sky Mantis. Uh, it's uh, designed and built in the United Kingdom. Uh, and uh, is now available in the United States uh, through myself and through, uh, through various resellers. And we're here with RMUS today to talk to them about this. Uh, the, uh, the Sky Mantis was designed on a spec for UK public safety. Uh, they required a one hour flight time. We hit that objective with a 30 times optical zoom camera, full thermal imager on board. They wanted uh, IP55 capability, so uh, it's capable of full flight in rain. We fly in all day at every rain. Uh, that's UK weather. Uh, and also we have very strong winds in the UK, especially in the coastal regions. And uh, so the very flat design and short legs, etc., is designed to give it high wind resistance. And we can fly, we're certified up to 47 miles an hour uh, for winds. So uh, very well, high was it? Usually resistance. more than anybody wants to fly in. Yeah, like, exactly. Yeah, make you yeah. uncomfortable one. Yeah, it makes me that uncomfortable flying speed. at very strong winds, but it copes with it just fine. Yeah. Uh, we have people flying this off coastal cliffs, doing search and rescue operations along the southern coast of Eastbourne uh, in the UK. So, uh, so this is uh, this was built with that. The other requirement was uh, temperature range. We've worked very, very hard to seal it up and give it a good temperature range. So we can go to minus 40 degrees centigrade to plus 50 degrees centigrade, Ooh. Uh, and that's extremes. So uh, uh, yeah, we've flown uh, it again. And tested you don't want to be out there. You don't want to be yeah. out there flying in that. So uh, yeah, <laughs> if you're pulling out that kind of weather, this this week gotta... at 100 deg 110 degrees Fahrenheit in the desert in uh, Las Vegas was uh, an experience for a Brit, but uh, we were there. <laughs> It was so, plenty. Yep. Um, well, I mean, we just put this up and obviously a really quiet platform, but some of yes. the things that, that we love about this platform, I mean, you mentioned the thermal camera, 645 by 512 resolution yep. and a 30 what times? 30 optical? times thirty times optically at the moment. We're actually increasing that up to more optical zoom in the near future with a camera change. Perfect. So, uh, and interchangeable payloads. Yep. Quick swap obviously. payloads. Swappable batteries yep. with a lithium ion yep. chemistry as yep. opposed to a lithium yep. polymer. Long endurance batteries are all mm. built for uh, that out one hour flight time, which we manage with the payload on full spec. Right. Um, and then to increase that further, we have a tether capability and uh, the uh, tether plugs into the bottom of the aircraft. It is literally a battery change to go from tether mode to non-tether mode. There's a hole in the bottom of the aircraft. The cable pushes up into the bottom. You fly off with the tether. We've done a 48 hour flight with the tether. And then uh, at any time, if you see something that you can't get the right aspect on because you're on the tether, you can drop the tether in flight and you've still got half a battery. 30 minutes worth of, uh, in yeah. our case, of flight time. Ex exactly, and as a lot of the people, or a lot of our customers have discovered, you know, the pain points with tether systems is that the manufa a lot manufacturers, a lot of them don't manufacture a tether system. Yep. Therefore, if you use a tether, your warranty is voided. Yep. And if it goes down, you're on your own. That that's not, not the case yep. with this platform. They have a tether made by the manufacturer that's made to integrate with the aircraft. And what I love, I love that option to be able to drop it. Yep. And you still, and it's not just gonna fall out of the sky. Nope. And that's the thing about all these other tether systems is, oh, somebody bumps the, somebody bumps the inverter, somebody bumps the generator, I ran out of gas. Yep it's going to yep. fall out of the sky. Yep. So having that backup battery, the ability yep. to drop it when you when is necessary is obviously a, yep. a massive feature, something that's really nice to have. But overall, I mean, we've been really impre impressed with this platform with the the remotes, the way that those system works with with a ruggedized tablet with HDMI out, it can also be plugged in. You're talking 3 to 4 hours on your on your remote with a thousand yep. nits of brightness on the yep. on the screen, yep. right? So overall, I mean, uh, overall just complete package that seems like it checks all the boxes for sure. We hope so and uh, we, you know, we, we've been very successful in Europe, moving across Europe it's time to come to this side of the pond and that's why I'm here. Sure, sure. And then I mean obviously we want to move farther, talking about training and all that kind of stuff. That's yep. probably going to come at a later date and we'll, we'll start working on this. But I mean that's your kind of look at the Evolve Dynamics. We've been really impressed with this and just anecdotally we put this in the air and myself and the other guys on the camera are nodding their heads when I say it, it was extremely quiet. Yeah. A very quiet platform. That was one thing that was really very impressive. Um, and uh, deliberately uh, that so. was I, I, I was shocked. I mean, honestly, we have one of those little Honda inverters that just sits there and purrs. This was quieter than, than the inverter by far. 
Absolutely. By far. So once you get up to 360 feet, which is how how long our tether is, you can't hear it anymore. Yeah, I, I believe it 100%. So, I mean, that's kind of our first look at the platform. We're excited to you know do a little bit more with it and and see where we go from here. So thanks for coming out and taking a look at it. Thank you. Okay.